In this short tutorial, you'll learn how to set up your very first Simbound page, how to add content to it, and then how to check if the page looks good on different screens. From the main dashboard, click on the web icon. You will be prompted with a decision to select the market for which you want to build the page and also other visual options. Feel free to add a few products onto your home page. You'll notice that as you select more products, a message appears that says that an additional page will be created for every additional product that you select. Don't forget to update the page description. Your page is ready, but your work is not over yet. You have to edit any content to match your brand identity, the value proposal, or anything that you see important in the way you market your products. Make sure to tweak different elements of the web page and notice how the score of the page, which is displayed to the right hand side beneath the funnel analytics chart, will change and update as you make changes to the web page. You can select which web page to work on from the drop down menu inside the browser emulator, where you can have a few different options when it comes to changing the look and feel of your content. You can upload your own pictures and apply different filters to the photos or you can change the name of your team and improve the standard motto. You can also duplicate pages in order to test how your visitors react to different changes between two versions of the same page. Feel free to edit the content and the description of the products that you're selling and also make changes to the pricing. When you change the price of your products, make sure that you don't put a too low or a too high price as this will impact either your sales or your profitability. You can add more products to your web pages and for each product that you select, an additional web page will be created. You can also remove products if needed by clicking on the actions and then the minus symbol. You can turn the edit mode to off if you want to browse the website as one of your visitors would. You can also test how your website looks on different screens and make sure to make tweaks in different modes so that the content is readable. You can also compare your website to that of the other teams when you search for the products in the small search box in the browser emulator. Feel free to get inspiration and compare some of the strategies of the other teams to that of your team. So this concludes our short tutorial where we learned how to set up a new landing page, how to edit an existing landing page, how to check how it looks on different devices, how to change its description, change its visuals, check out the stats, create a duplicate of the page, search for other pages in the game and also check out the score.